Hey, what is up guys? Apple Advanced here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to download an NES emulator back again on iOS 9.3.3 device or iOS 10 betas. This will work for any type of iOS device or any type of iPhone, so that's the best thing about this method. You can have um, an iPhone 4, iPhone 5, iPhone 6, iPhone 6S Plus, really anything in any iOS 10 beta, and that's the best thing about this method. And also you can get as long as any many games as you want to, as long as there are any games you can play Mario Galactica and t so many other games um, on your I iPhone and it's it's amazing it's amazing um, and uh, mostly the methods I cover on my channel usually are able to get revoked or they do not support certain softwares but this you know supports everything so if you guys want to enjoy the video don't forget to drop that thumbs up down below if you haven't subscribed or turn on my notification go ahead and do so right now and let's begin with today's tutorial Okay, so the first step of this tutorial is actually quite easy, really easy install and everything, but there is a couple things I need to tell you at the end so you know how to install the games. Um, so originally this was an AdFly link, so basically when you went through the link it would um, you know, come up with an ad and then you could skip the ad. Well, I had that removed so you don't have to go through that process like I had to because whoever has this link previously gets paid for it every time you click on the AdFly link. So I was like, you know what, I'm not going to give them the advantage and give them the money because this is actually not the person who um, actually gives out this app. So therefore, it shouldn't really be going to them if they had, don't even, you know, own the app or anything. So um, it's just a straight URL in the description below. Um, so basically, just head on to Safari, you know, go to that description. And it'll look just like this, a blank page for me, but but that's because I've already uh, know how to do it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and like reload it, and then boom, it's gonna come up the prompt asking you if I would like to install it or not. Go ahead and click install. It's gonna ask you for your passcode. Now remember, if you're like on your mom's device or something like that, like um, just remember to ask permission before you do anything like this. Um, for video purposes, I've changed my password um, because you know, like not everybody um, wants to have their password be known to like an app that isn't from the app store so that's another thing just in case you know uh because i don't want to be blamed for it for anything like that you know ask permission first um so just go ahead and click on it but i'm gonna go ahead and change it to my front page real quick click on it and i'll come up with like two games uh from the start it'll be like super mario bros or whatever and there will also be this button at the bottom like the plus button if you click it then this is how like you basically get the um, games and stuff like that because if you click the plus button then it will take you to a uh, dropbox and um, it'll basically be like you know sign into your dropbox and all and what it's basically what I'm trying to say is um, you have to download these NES games separately and the way you do it is just like download them on your mobile device and let them load up and then just export them to your dropbox account and um, once you sign in with your Dropbox, you just click on the um, thing. So let's say you already have it downloaded the game. Well, then um, let's go ahead and X out the app so I can just basically show you. So basically, like, let's say you already have the game downloaded on your Dropbox. You have the Dropbox signed in on this app. You just click the plus button at the bottom, okay? And then it would come up with your Dropbox account, and it would be like, okay, which game would you like to play? You'd click on the game, and you basically start it up, and you can play it. Um, but there's already, like, two default games. Um, obviously, most people are just probably going to play Super Mario Bros., um, but that's it. I mean, it's actually quite an easy method. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop that thumbs up down below. Um, if you were, you know, already subscribed and stuff like that, you know, liking the video always helps out. It tells me that you guys want more content like this on the channel because I upload tons of emulators and hacked apps and stuff like that. And uh, maybe some how to get some free games and stuff like that. But um, that's basically it. You know, um, if you guys uh, have any problems, try to let me know in the comment session. Um, comment section, sorry about that. But yeah, that wraps it up, and uh, this has been Apple Advanced, and see you guys.